A ribbon-cutting ceremony took place on July 1, 2014 at Marone Bio Innovations in Bangor, located in southwest Michigan. The California-based company is a leading global provider of bio-based pest management in plant health products. They began manufacturing its biopesticides in late December 2013 inside a vacant, bankrupt former biodiesel plant, and their products are getting rave reviews from local farmers. Gordon Grove is plant manager at the Marone, Michigan manufacturing facility. Marone, in concert with the USDA and especially Debbie Stabenow um, from the Ag Senate Committee, was very influential in helping Marone see how diverse of products were in southwest Michigan here. Um, from there, they identified this Michigan biodiesel facility that came available. Um, they saw a lot of promise in the facility, and there was a lot of vision, had to have a lot of vision. The biodiesel process is a much different process than what we currently do with fermentation process, which is a very sterile process, very sterile facility. Uh, we did a lot of remediation of the site, cleanup of the site, and basically gutted the entire facility and in, made a major investment with a lot of assistance and help from the USDA to purchase new equipment to bring in the facility to make it as it is today. Marone Manufacturing here in Bangor is specifically producing biologically friendly pesticides. They're naturally derived from organisms or plants, extractions from plants. The organisms are, that we find, that we use, are found all across the world. Um, we find and isolate in our corporate offices, in our R&D facilities in Davis, California, organisms that specific, specifically um, defend plants against particular pests, whether the pests are bugs or whether the pests are weeds. Um, locally here in Michigan and actually all across the, the world, these products are being used for strawberries, blueberries, apples in the area here, plums, tomatoes, um, and across the world, many different fruits, vegetables. We're now starting to get into row crops, corn crops, um, soybeans. This is naturally occurring. Matter of fact, these applications of regalia, you don't have the re-entry periods that you do with most common use products. 